Welcome to your weekend. We made it to Friday. It's been a really nice week overall. I mean, a little hazy and smoky, but the wind has taken care of that for us. We ha don't have any uh, air quality advisories right now. Now we are looking at clear breezy skies, but guess what? We're going to heat up tomorrow, like spike up to the triple digits briefly and then head right back down to below normal. So it's just a weird little anomaly tomorrow. Very hot conditions. On top of that, we've got thunderstorms and strong gusty winds moving into the area. These thunderstorms could produce lots of uh, cloud to ground lightning, which could start new fires. Also going to bring some strong erratic gusty winds and then potential mountain flooding, especially in those burn zones uh, where all the soil is loose. The trees are gone. We could see some flooding or even even some mudslides in certain areas in the Cascade Mountains. I'll preface that with the Cascade Mountains and the East Slope. So you want to be careful, especially if you're heading in those directions over the weekend. Temperatures tonight looking pretty good. Like I said, we'll see breezy conditions, mostly clear skies overnight. So not a bad night. Enjoy that. We do have this fire weather watch right now again for most of our area. Ellensburg to Yakima all the way east to College Place south of Hermiston and Hepner Goldendale down the Columbia River Gorge. Once again, this is due to abundant lightning, erratic strong winds gusting up to 50 miles an hour. Along with these thunderstorms, we could also see some hail. We're talking about a half an inch to three quarters of an inch hail. Most of that will be contained to the Cascade Mountains. Now here's where the flood threat is. We could see some flat, uh, flash flood here in the Cascade Mountains and on the East Slopes heading towards the Yakima, Ellensburg and Clee Ellum areas. So be very safe this weekend if you're heading out. Uh, let's talk about tomorrow for the first part of the day. Looking good. Look at that. Mostly sunny skies. Uh, it's going to be fairly calm to start with. We'll start to see uh, beautiful skies in the afternoon with warm temperatures and then that heat wave that spike comes later in the day. Now after five or six or so tomorrow night is when things get unsettled and that's where we're going to see those clouds moving in those thunderstorms potentially even in the lower Columbia Basin and down the Yakima Valley, the lower valley towards Sunnyside. So again, be safe. It's kind of an active weekend, but enjoy the little bit of nice weather and then things calm down immensely on Sunday. For all the details, tune in tonight at 5, 6 and 11.